Today we're at 1435 Grayland Creek Place. It's just been renovated. It's a moving inspection. With all these trees, we have a concern with gutters, especially along the back uh, that are full. You notice gutters are not present on the front. Looks like a newly replaced architectural uh, shingle roof. Siding is in good shape. Let's take a look along the sides. Soffit and fascia are good. Down limbed recently. Not sure if the floodlights work out back. Tenant is concerned of safety. One of the safety issues are the boards along this back deck. As you can see, uh, we have some drama under here that needs to be addressed. They are very loose. There are some boards that are actually missing uh, a third of their normal size. Let's go up on the deck real quick. First board. You can see there's a splinter that's been put in between there. We don't want anybody twisting their ankle. Some of the boards are lifting up. We just need some deck screws to secure. And then underneath, this goes down a good three quarters of an inch on the left. It's more like a teeter totter. But we do need the gutter cleaned out along the back. We got some plant life growing over here. It's overflowing. We also have some buildup in that gutter there. A little bit of damage to siding over here. This is wood siding. Here's our gas meter. Brand new air conditioning unit and handler inside. It's in great shape. Cedar shake siding in the front is going to need to be replaced or uh, correct correction probably repainted soon. All right, here in the entryway, our first concern is the entry door light does not work. Uh, right here in the hall, let's go left in the kitchen for the dining room first. Into the kitchen, another concern is the brand new vent hood that was installed along with the new uh, stove. Does not work. The light does, but the vent hood does not. New appliances, brand new refrigerator has an ice maker. Uh, the line is not attached to the back. There is a missing garage door opener remote that has the tenant very concerned as there is not a lockable door that goes to the interior. Basically this is an interior door lock but all you need is a coin to turn it and it makes this uh, locking mechanism basically obsolete. So we're going to request that a deadbolt be put in there uh, with a new locking knob that matches the front door. Down the hall, we do have security measures. We have a smoke detector. We have carbon monoxide uh, sensor. Brand new carpet. 
Home is in great shape. New light fixtures. We have a fireplace that is gas assist, and there is uh, no key present for that gas assist unit. This light does not work. Uh, the patio light the switch does not work. They did put new bulbs in there. The master suite has raised ceilings. Again, new carpet. There's additional storage out this door. This is an addition that a brand new light bulb in this light and it does not work. So at night this room is not useful. And we have two sinks, vanity area, garden tub, Toilet does not flush. Need to have an adjustment on the lever. New light fixture. And a walk in closet here. That concludes our inspection of 1435.